Oh, how are you now, YouTubes? I'm doing good myself, except for this damn cold. Holy crap, is this ever shit. So I've been doing some thinking about that blend gate problem I got with the friggin' car, where, you know, you fire it up in the cold and say, tuck, 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 because the blend gate's, like, sticking. And I got thinking, I wonder if it's due to this. You know, a lot of people have been, uh, saying that the, it happens on their G6 that this is a common fault for it but I honestly wonder because it happens in the beginning like when it's cold out it happens and then as the car warms up and more heat blows through then it just stops so obviously whatever's sticking frees up and then moves or it either the other option is it just says fuck it and quits but it sounds like it's actually starting to move after a while, so it obviously unthaws. So I'm questioning if it's a lot of vapor junk that got stuck around the mechanism, because that shit will stick to your windshield, right? And when it sticks to your windshield, if you heat it up, it actually doesn't, doesn't take it off, but uh, it displaces it enough that you can see through your windshield. But in the winter, she'll freeze right up, and you'll get about a good millimeter thin piece of ice right across your windshield from fucking vape snot so I question if that's what caused it not saying everybody on YouTube's who's posted this problem as a video is on the e-darts could be other things happening in their areas could just be a, a damp area in the summer and water accumulates in there and then come cold weather she just fucking freezes her tits off and game over who knows but seems the only time I can replicate the problem is when it's minus 20 or below. Other than that, I don't get the issue. Well, as far as I know, because keep in mind, I fire up the car a good 10, 15 minutes prior to going to work when it's this cold, because who the hell wants to jump into an ice box and freeze their tits off or drive to work? Nobody does. So, spend some gas and fucking heat that cocksucker up. So that's what I'm doing right now. She's on the, she's on the warm cycle, so we'll let that warm up and go from there. So, I'm questioning if maybe it is vape snot that got into the back burners and caused my problems. Well, today is Saturday, and tonight is supposed to be the live stream. Whether or not I stream is all depending on how I feel tonight. I know I won't be drinking, that's for sure. If anything, I'll be on the old gov juice or water, because uh, from this point going forward, I think I'm going to quit beer. <laughs> I think I'm going to... Uh, give her the old shutdown routine and uh, yeah it's not doing me any favors so fuck it I'm gonna uh, quit beer and uh, well not permanently there but um, I'm gonna put her on the back burner for a bit and switch over just a high quality H2O and see about losing some fucking poundage cause uh you know, flexibility and my ability and all that shit there, she's getting pretty weak. So I should probably fucking tame her down on the liquors and focus more on stuff and junk. But enough about that. We got to head off to work shortly because I started the vlog late today. It's actually uh, 9 minutes to 8.30. So fucking pitter-patter, boys. Alrighty, stump humpers. Let's get the fuck out of here, go to work, put in today's shift, and then tomorrow's shift. Then I'll have three days off to fucking recuperate from all the damages this cold has caused. Blah! Oh, I need another pack of hauls. I killed the one I brought to work with me yesterday. Jesus, Murphy. Had the car running for a good 15 minutes now. And you can still hear the friggin' ticking. Damn you, Blendgate. Damn you all to hell. Well, I was gonna do a driving vlog today. But fuck. I guess that's out. Alright, let's go to work. Oh, friggin' rights. Blendgate issue stopped. Now we can get the hell out of here. Go to work and actually do a rolling vlog. It's been a while since I've done one of these. Fuckers thought we were gonna evade it. 
because of uh, the blend gate issue, but uh, she seems to have corrected herself. So once again, heat prevails. This is why I question if it's vape buildup on the motor or the actuator or just the fucking gate itself. Because you know, that shit does freeze. I did have to scrape both my passenger windows today on the inside mainly because she was rather gooey and I have no traction right now. Lovely. Roads look bare, don't they? No, that's black ice people. Roads are far from fucking bare. Whoever the city of North Bay hired to maintain the streets this year, they sure aren't doing their part in maintaining the streets this year. Fucking plow. I remember before, when it was, uh, before it was the city of North Bay that would do it, we had our own plow trucks. Now we sublet to uh, other companies. But when we were doing it ourselves, let me tell you, they would scrape the streets and then salt them and sand them and they did a good job. This new group, fuck. They just can't be bothered to give two cares. Just like this guy in this Dodge beside me. Fuck, he's in my lane and his lane. Move over, bud. Can't drive a big truck, don't buy a big truck, you dumb fuck. Oh, but I gotta own a big truck. I gotta let people know I'm a man. Cause I'm a man, I drive a big truck, not a little stupid car. Manly truck, man, man, man. Holy fuck, I just smell like some real serious Vaseline right now coming through my vents. That's not good. Usually when you smell burning Vaseline like that, it means your car's probably ablaze. Yeah, we'll play it out and see what happens. Yeah, at least we're recording now, so the car does catch fire and fire shoots out the vents. It look pretty cool on the camera, because I think you can see the vent in the screenshot. Probably look pretty badass. So I'm hoping for an easy peasy day today, because fuck sakes, coughing into a, a fucking dizzy daze is just not working for me. Neither is talking. The more I talk, the more it like, irritates my throat, but you know, I got this vlog a day commitment thing I'm keeping to myself. So fuck the show must go on. And since the new policy at work of no paid sick days, kind of can't afford to miss work anymore when I get ill. Because if I do, I, I don't get paid. And if I don't get paid, I can't pay my mortgage. And if I can't pay my mortgage, well, fuck, there goes the rape shack that I live in. I don't have to find a new place to live. So you got to work through the sickness, for fuck's sakes. It sucks. What's even more stupid is they expect you to get a doctor's note calling sick. Uh, for three days in a row. It's like, fuck you, not paying me for it, so why the fuck should I go to the doctor, pay that cocksucker ten bucks, just so you can write a note saying, Adam was sick, but he's okay. Fuck off. I got work to do. I can understand if it was a paid sick day and you want to proof that I was sick so that uh, you can pay me, but if it's not paid sick day, you do not require a note. I don't care if uh, me being ill reduces production. Me being ill and at work will reduce production even more as I get other people infected with whatever the fuck I have, just saying. But obviously these business types, call centers in general, they don't give a fuck. They never have, they never will. You gotta be one type of person to wanna be a manager at a call center. That's a piece of shit. Like you gotta be a massive piece of shit to wanna be a manager there. Like, I mean the biggest fucking shit stain on the planet Earth. Be able to sit there and realize lives that you're torturing just so you can make a fucking dollar. So you can make $36,000 a year as a manager at a call center. Big piece of shit. You know what I mean? Yeah, you probably do. But anyway, people, I'm gonna cut it here. I know you fucking love the driving vlogs. But uh, anyway, we'll check back in tonight when we're done work. All right, peace the fuck out. The weather really took a change. Well, it did for five seconds, and then that showed me volume zero. Minus five degrees Celsius, no click of death, cool. Anyway, it's time to go home, so fuck pitter-patter. I'm not gonna make a vlog, I'm gonna have to concentrate on driving because, uh, you know what, I'm gonna film, but music over super fast. Reason being is the roads are a fucking skating ring, people, and um, uh, yeah, probably gonna die. Let's go. Sure enough, right where I turned the camera off, shortly after that I'm turning, and uh, <clears throat> didn't look like any cars would come. I couldn't see over the snowbank, but normally I look for artificial light coming down the road, and that's how I make my judgment call. Just seeing clear. Oh, I farted. Better do that outside. Fuck, they've been ranked today. But uh, seeing clear as so I go, fucking Toyota Celica with uh, poppy uppy headlights, like a classic, like 1990s one. Maybe earlier than that. I don't know what year those came out. Anyway, as I was saying before I had to let the dog out. Um, basically, 
Uh, it was coming down the road, its headlights were closed. Assuming either A, the motors are shot, or B, the headlights are frozen, and he probably didn't have far to go and figured, fuck it, I'll risk it and just boot scoot home. Fuck, did I bring my. Oh, son of a bitch. Oh, crisis averted. Got my juice. Holy fuck, I almost had an aneurysm, boys. So, to speed up the process, when I went to the store today to get some ginger ale, I noticed they had this product there called Cold Effects. The fuck you doing, dog? Poop in the yard. I was fucking trying to climb on my car and take a shit, little asshole. Only I'm allowed to do that. But anyway, they have this product there called Cold Effects, and I remember that always worked on me in the past. And there was a study done saying it's a fucking hoax and it don't work. It's a placebo. Well, this morning, I could barely function. I was like fucking just wrecked. Like really badly wrecked. I did my best, went to work, put in my time. Fucking like a champ. Hacking and coughing and drinking my ginger ale and popped a couple cold effects and all of a sudden I started feeling better like shortly after, like about an hour into it. Started feeling pretty good. <coughs> oh, excuse me. So then, you know, it started wearing off, wearing off, wearing off, and then it was gone and fucking said, fuck it, I'm popping another one. So I cracked another one off. Felt fucking great again. Able to finish my shift. And right now my cold's coming, or not my cold, but my cough's starting to act up. So I'm just going to say, fuck it. I want to. Drive this steak here into the air fryer. Have steak for supper. Fucking wag you. So now I just gotta wait for the fur bat to come in. Come on, dude. <clears throat> here he comes. Oh, focus, you fuck. There we go. So I'm really hoping. Uh, hoping? That's like opening and hoping. Fuck. Takes you. I'm really hoping that it doesn't snow on my three days off because, uh,. I gotta get rid of this fucking cold. This is getting ridiculous and it's gotta go. Like, how the fuck did I even catch this? Oh, never mind. I work in a plague factory. <laughs> of course I know how I caught this. Fuck. Alrighty, well, I'm gonna let that thing fucking cook. Let's just check and see if I had anything to drink. And, uh, yes, I do. I think I'm gonna fuck over this can of tomato juice. Aw, oh, hell yeah. Fuck, I love tomato juice. Looks like I need to buy a new one of these today, or later on. Fucking bent the shit out of it trying to get it in a tomato juice can. So I had to take the whole fucking lid off. Lovely. Fucking right, it's better than a beer. Motherfucking tomato juice. I love tomato juice, it's so good. Just fucking look at it. Would you just fucking look at it? That's my dinner, guys. So I'm gonna go eat that, edit up this video, get it up to YouTube's. And I'm going to bed. I know tonight's Saturday night, and tonight is live stream night. But I feel like a bag of smashed assholes, so I'm backing on the live stream. And I'm going to bed. So, maybe we'll do one tomorrow night, maybe we won't. I don't fucking know. All I know is, is I need to eat, watch some TV, chill the fuck out, drink a Neo Citroen, go to bed. So on that note, thanks for watching my video, hopefully you enjoyed it. Kitten. If you did, be sure to you fucking defocusing piece of There we go. If you did enjoy my video, give it a like, click. Any questions, comments, concerns, down below they go. And until next time, people, keep on vlogging.